yesterday evening and something happened right here in lovely Kingsport, Tennessee, Sullivan County. Eastman Chemical Company, which is the company right behind me, their power went down. On the south end of the plant, their power went down. And what did that mean? Well, it said uh, due to a power failure, the Eastman Chemical, Eastman Chemical Company has released iodine and methyl iodide. Well, what is methyl iodide? Methyl iodide is used in pesticides. It's been known to be a carcinogenic. In other words, it can cause cancer. It's harmful to your lungs, your thyroid. And yesterday with the power outage right here at the Eastman Chemical Company, iodine and methyl iodide was released into the atmosphere. How much, I don't know. They didn't exactly say. And also today on an update, uh, an update from the Eastman Chemical Company, they said that hydraulic oil, hydraulic oil, and also ethylene glycol was released into the Holston River. I do know in January 2021 that 5,000 pounds, 5,000 pounds of, of ethylene glycol was released into the Holston River. That's what's in antifreeze, ethylene glycol. So yesterday, iodine and methyl iodide was released into the atmosphere. I do know that standing out here earlier, my eyes was burning, and that's a result of methyl iodide, which is using pesticides. Also, earlier this year, 300,000 pounds or 300,000 gallons. That's right, earlier this year, 300, according to the news, earlier this year, 300,000 gallons of waste water, waste water, right, and hydraulic fluid was released into the ri river, according to a report I read. So, how safe is the environment in Kingsport? I don't know. You let me know. I love the community. Eastman employs around 1,100,000 workers. They support, they are the fabric and, and part of the pillar of the Eastman, uh, uh, excuse me, they are the fabric and part of the you know, the backbone, the support of our community. They employ, according to what I read, around 11,000 workers. They're the, around the fifth largest company as far as employees goes in Tennessee, from what I read. So all I know is over the last year and a half, we have had hydraulic oil, hydraulic oil, and ethylene glycol, and wastewater released into the host, South Fork Hosting River from the Eastman Chemical Company. So, long story short, yes, they are pollu pollu polluting our community, our waterways, our air. That's all I got to say. It is what it is. Please like, comment, subscribe as always. Be happy, positive, and focused. I know this video will probably make a lot of people mad. Hey, it is what it is. You know, I think a lot of this is kind of swept under the rug, you know. Uh, they didn't say how much was released, and what happened is the power went out, and so they had to release because according, I don't know, some kind of steam line went down, whatever. So they had to release iodine or, or, it, or it did happen or did they or they did release iodine and methyl iodide into the air. I do know methyl iodide is poisonous. If breathed in between medium to large doses can be fatal. It's, it, it can damage your eyes, your kidneys, your thyroid, and it's been known to cause cancer. So is Eastman Chemical Company polluting our community, our environment? It's a common sense question with a common sense answer. answer. Yes. That's all I've got to say about that. Please like, comment, subscribe as always. Be happy, positive, and focused. Share my videos right here on the Big O Show, the only place to go. Be happy, positive, and focused. If you ain't laughing, you ain't living. Ha, 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 ha. I'm always happy. Live, I live in the moment. I'm energetic, persuasive, dynamic. I will see you all down late on down the road. And the company behind me is the Eastman Chemical Company. It's a huge company. Stop the pollution. Get a grip on it. Of course, it was an accident, you know, but things happen, hey. But they still are polluting our community. There goes out with a shot.